something on that day. And now, it's too late to stop. Moonfall. I just got out of an early screening for this particular film. Thanks for the tickets, Fudge. Now then, was it any good? Well, first off, Moonfall is a disaster adventure film about a mysterious force causing the moon to fall out of orbit while a disgraced astronaut, his ex-partner, and a conspiracy theorist try to figure out what's happening and why. And it's not great. Nope not bad per se, but there's quite a few baffling choices in the film. On the looks level, the effects are decent, some fun destruction sequences of iconic cities and some neat shots. Sound design is fine as well, nothing really stand out there. The story is all sorts of stupid though, <laughs> filled with standard sci-fi tropes and cliches. Halfway through the film, it sort of gives it away and is rather predictable from there on, but the main plot is still serviceable. Stupid, but works just fine to get the story moving at a brisk pace to keep up the fun. But that's just the main plot. Oh yeah, there's an entire B plot here that follows quite a few side characters that don't really matter to the overall story. Michael Pena is in the film for all of five minutes before having a very big emotional scene, and it's just not deserved. It feels very, very forced. And the pacing in this B plot is awful. It's way too quick with no breathing room aside from characters staring in awe at the destruction around them. It's very clearly just an excuse to show off more disaster scenes, but that's the thing. You don't need a B-plot to do that. You can just show the destruction. It doesn't need side characters to have a reason to be shown. You can literally cut them all out of the movie and not miss a single thing. But then the film would be shorter than 90 minutes, so... Meh. The humor also doesn't really hit that well either. There's one comic relief character and the jokes are just puns, or him going, ha ha, I'm a nerd, out of place. They aren't really clever, and for some reason there are several callouts to SpaceX and Elon Musk, which feel very forced, I would not be surprised if SpaceX sponsored this film. There's also a weirdly out of place Shining reference for some reason in the beginning of the film. There's just quite a few narrative choices that bug me and either don't make sense or feel shoehorned in for tension that just doesn't land. There's three characters that show up shortly, have interesting looks, and then are immediately gone. Or one that has one interesting scene and then is immediately gone as well, with a reference to his outcome and it's just why why have them there they offer nothing that the characters wouldn't have figured out or done on their own it's just a weird weird choice i don't know it's a fine movie maybe relies a little too heavily on deus ex machina sometimes literally it's competently made but the overall story is just dumb i mean that's excusable at the least the visuals are cool there's plenty of destruction too but the beat plot is just terrible the jokes are terrible and frankly it's just so so if i was going to improve it i would say there needs to be more of a focus on the main plot, the B-plot you really don't need, and maybe less comic relief. If you're going to go for, this is an admittedly goofy story, but if you're going to take it seriously, take it seriously and go with it. Anyway, as it is, it's just okay. It's very, very mediocre. Moonfall gets a 5 out of 10 from me. Hey, hey guys, thanks for sticking around for another one of these. Uh, I'm so glad I got to see this in a uh, early screening. I really like early screenings, gets me on top of the ball here. But ooh, I went into this not knowing what to expect, and that's good for a lot of films, but this one just, mm, I was not a fan of it very much. I can see how some people would get into it and like some parts, but for me, it just didn't work. Save your money, skip it. Otherwise, it'll be in theaters in a couple weeks. Anyway, that's all for today. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell so you don't miss a video upload or uh, just want to hear me talk some more. Uh, follow my Twitter if you want. Uh, have a great day, and if you're not, have a better one. See ya.